to explain why I have blonde hair, and you rewind a little bit. Oh, for this video, I had one of my producers challenge me to have my fans control my life. I spontaneously posted polls that you voted for and I would have to complete no matter what. So to start off this video, I asked my fans, should I go to Korea or Canada to film for the next 48 hours? What could go wrong? Ah. Oh man, we're lost. Wow. Anzio. Currently 53% say Canada. All right. Should I go to Korea or Canada? Korea. Korea. Really? Yeah. Oh. 61% currently say Korea. Let's go get our tickets. As you can already tell, no matter how much planning I do, a single poll can throw everything out the window. So I just brought my passport and this bag. We'll see if there's actually any tickets left. After talking to the ticket clerk, who was also a fan, he said the flight was full. The problem is, we booked this too last minute, like literally. Even the manager came out to help us find tickets. Hey, you guys are super cool over here, working hard. They managed to find two tickets to Korea, but it leaves in 45 minutes. Wow, we are pushing this. We scrambled across the airport to security. With literally minutes to spare, we made Made it onto our flight. Here we go to Korea. Let's go. I'll only be in Korea for 48 hours, and my producer told me there's no way I could film six videos in 48 hours. He said that if I pulled off all six, he'd watch my kids for two weeks, but if I failed, he'd get a raise and I'd be his personal assistant for a week. I'm putting up a poll that says, how should we get to the city? Nobody wants to take a taxi. It looks like we are using our magic. So this is how I get from the airport to Seoul. Okay. That worked. I'm gonna do another poll and just say, what should I eat for dinner? Ramen and Korean barbecue. 63% say ramen. Oh, 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 oh. And I thought they didn't have any ramen. Um, that's what I'm talking about. MSG or whatever that is, that's good stuff. This is a good view. I love the smell of gasoline with my ramen. The jet lag is hitting hard, so I'm gonna head to bed and we'll shoot some fun videos tomorrow. Since I'm in Korea, I want to make some really fun trick videos. So I'm going to ask you guys, should I film with a popular food dish or should I film featuring an animal? Right now it's 60% animal. To do that, down the street is actually one of those 3D billboards. We're getting a little creative on the word animal here. Just to give you guys context for how big this billboard is, this is how big the billboard is. This trick replaces the 3D billboard ad with our own 3D aquarium. That way I can make it look like I'm feeding a shark. Because I only had one outfit, I had to wait between takes to let my clothes dry. By the time I got the perfect shot, we were an hour and a half behind schedule. But as long as I rush to the next set, I'll be able to shoot the second video for the day. Oh, darn. Well, that's what I thought until my producer posted a poll saying, should I run or take a taxi? Are you kidding me? That's not fair. So we're right now racing Zach down to the bottom and we got on a bus and uh, we're gonna see if we beat him. I think we're doing pretty good right now. I hope he doesn't win. Wonder if the team is ahead or behind of me. We gotta get a taxi now. Zach's gonna beat us. They're in a taxi. I mean, come on, how hard could that be? That didn't work. The one thing that could save me, traffic in Korea. I think we are doing good time, right? We almost crashed. Almost ate that taxi. I think we're okay. I think it's kind of even right now. It's anyone's race at this point. I have his phone. Maybe he got lost. I don't know if I'm going the right way. I hope Zach got lost. Ah. Oh man. No. But I mean like not for long. I hope we find him fast. If you <laughs> even though I was the winner, we're all losers because we are two hours behind. So we had to skip the next video to stay on track. On to our last trick for today. You guys wanted me to shoot with a K-pop star. So we got a special guest inside. We are going to shoot the video in this really cool 2D cafe. Somi is the K-pop star that we'll be filming with. This is probably one of our biggest shoots while we're in Korea. So we had a lot of practice to do before she even showed up. It's crunch time. Uh, she could be here any minute and we are we're ready. We're ready. Somi arrives and we get straight into rehearsing her blocking and reactions. Since the trick ends with coffee being spilled all over me and ruining an outfit, I only had two full attempts to get that right. What's going on? Oh, did I get on? Oh. Clean up. Thankfully, on our final attempt, we got some great reactions from Somi and the perfect coffee spill. Because we only completed two of the six tricks so far, we'll have to complete four tricks tomorrow in order to finish the challenge. Sorry. 2D keeps doing that. I don't even know what's going on. You guys vote that I face my fear, so I'm going to the top of this building, I'm gonna go across the sky bridge. This tower is 123 stories high and my worst nightmare. I'm already nervous. I have a deep fear of heights and this pool is worse than when I had to run back to the hotel. Ah. <sighs> oh man, the only other people to do this for free has been Tom Cruise and BTS and now it's me, that's pretty crazy. All right, here we go. Oh, the wind doesn't make this easier. I do not know about this. Yeah, that's, that's strong, right? At this moment, I was the most nervous I've ever been. I kept thinking of backing out, but I've already come so far and I'm not gonna lose to a simple pull. I mustered up all my confidence and started to cross. I can't look down, don't look down. Just look up. 
We are not high above a city right now. We're going over the glass. It's so windy. Crazy that buildings can withstand this kind of wind. This is a really cool experience. I was freaked out at first, but it's amazing when awe can like take over your fear. Sky Next up, you want me to do karaoke or do a Korean spa? The result is karaoke. I make YouTube videos, I don't sing. I got a bad feeling about this. This karaoke bar seems kind of sketchy. It's kind of like a horror movie. Oh, shoot, it's all in Korean. You guys Taylor Swift? It's a love story. It's a love story, baby, say yes. karaoke I hope you enjoyed we're gonna go to the next thing actually we're probably just gonna go to sleep one of our crew members is not showing up Anzio. good morning <laughs> yes I forgot to put my alarm clock on apparently so. tiredness is high karaoke baby, baby, oh. wipe this out team is wondering when we get to do some R&R &R, some rest and relaxation we're running a little late the bus is driving the wrong direction now we have to catch another bus. I kind of feel like we're lost. Hey, Emil, are we lost? Uh, there you have it, folks. We are definitely lost. But after a little direction correction, we made it. I did it. You I did, did it. it. Day two is already off to a terrible start. If we don't make up time, we have to skip yet another video. We're already about to fail this challenge. So I asked you guys if you want me to do a coffee experience or a matcha experience, and you guys picked coffee. So that's why I'm in one of the coolest cafes in Korea, which is themed after an ocean. This is a dolphin latte and it is so cute. Look at this little dolphin ice cube. He's made out of coffee. Reminder, before you come here though, be aware to check the tide report or else this might happen. <sighs> this is the life. Not only does my producer cause me headaches. I don't know if I'm going the right way. I do not know about this. He also gives the entire country of Korea a headache. So I just broke two of the Korean laws in one moment. I think I'm gonna move out of here. To get to my next shoe, should I take a taxi or public transportation? Okay, public transportation it is. I guess that means a bus or something or a train. We made it 45 minutes later. Uh, no idea. Going this way. English. We're lost. I follow the masses. I knew where we were the whole time. Soon after, we were able to film the second video of the day, and this one was particularly difficult because the jump cuts demanded perfection. There and reach for it, unfreeze. I was mostly concerned about the jump cut because they typically have a 30% failure rate. In the end, it worked out fine, except for this. Oh! <laughs> For once, we were actually ahead of schedule. So on our way to our last video, we managed to find the perfect hedge for this trick we missed yesterday. This was by far our easiest video to shoot, but I couldn't say the same about its post-production. It was a real pain. I asked you guys if I should get a tattoo or get my hair styled, and you guys picked hairstyles. So I headed to fair where I got to meet Mujin, who is an expert hairstylist for Korea's top celebrities. To start off, we explained the hair color changing trick, and then we got the footage. With that out of the way, I explained the hairstyle I was looking for, and Mujin got to work. First time. <laughs> 10,000 times? But this takes three hours, so he's done 30,000 hours, which means he's a triple black belt. It's gonna feel hot and spicy. Oh, there's a smell. Uh, they weren't joking, it's burning. Ah. Yeah. This might be permanent. This is gonna hurt the most. Very spicy. Uh, oh. uh, round two, washing part two. <laughs> Three, two, one. Whoa! Feels like a, a Snapchat filter. With my hair dyed, we got numerous takes for the second half of the trick. And with that, I filmed six successful tricks in 48 hours while my fans controlled my life in Korea. Looks like the producer's gonna have to watch my kids for two weeks. Update, so I, I actually didn't win the challenge. We realized that the last trick didn't actually work. No matter what shots we paired or effects or we tried the jump cut, it failed every single time. If you remember from earlier, I mentioned that jump cuts have a 30% failure rate. Well, this video is the 30% failure rate. Really a bummer, but uh, we pushed so hard for that 48 hours and overcame so many obstacles, but uh, yeah, just to fall short at the very end. So honestly, wouldn't be surprised if you didn't want to subscribe. That's okay. Here's a video right here. Yep, this is Emil's office. How may I help you? Here's your coffee and cookies, sir. Uh, yeah, no, he's my assistant for one week. Zach, I wanted this to be iced. Zach, did you drink out of this? Now this is R&R. &R.